today's video. I hope that you are all doing amazing. Today's video is a little vlog slash story time. I don't know. I don't know. Today is Sunday and on Friday I got my wisdom teeth removed. I got four of them removed and so the past few days I have been doing nothing at all and I'm probably gonna do nothing today too. So except I like... The week is starting tomorrow and so I feel like I need to clean up a little bit because I haven't been cleaning up and like doing anything. So yeah, I'm gonna clean up and probably chill. Chill and clean up and eat soup because that's all I'm eating. And I'm almost out of ice cream. But yeah, anyways, I thought I would tell you a little bit like how it went. So, cause I don't know, it's kind of like interesting. It's kind of fun. But basically on Friday at eight was my appointment to get my wisdom teeth removed and my mom took me. They took some x-rays of my teeth. I went into the room and it was, I was so stressed. I was so stressed. They had, they like attached me to like the this thing so they could look at my like, my heartbeat or whatever. I don't know, it was, it was freaking me out. Anyways, the hardest part was literally getting my IV in. I still have like a little bit of like marks. But anyways, that was the hardest part, but it wasn't even that bad, but it freaked me out. And then I thought they were gonna make me count down from like 10 and then like drug me so I would know like when I was being drugged, but they didn't really tell me. So like one second I was like looking around like awake and then and then I don't remember anything. They didn't really tell me. She told me, oh, this is just gonna make you relax. And so I thought it was just like, the pre, the pre-medication that was gonna make me relax. And then they were gonna like knock me out, but like, no, that was the one that knocked me out. But anyway, so I don't remember anything, but then I woke up. I don't remember waking up. I just remember being in my mom's car and I knew I wanted to take a picture of myself. <laughs> I don't know why, but like, I don't know, like everyone takes pictures of, them, of themselves with like after they get their wisdom teeth removed. So like, I knew, I knew I wanted to do that. So I took a couple pictures. I was not doing good though. <laughs> like I was, I don't know how I was feeling. I don't remember. I just remember being like, my mood was like, I was just like this, like just panicked. But like, I was upset. I was crying and I was just like, what? But it was fine. It wasn't like bad. I wasn't feeling like I was just I I don't know I was just like emotional a little. I don't know why but yeah next day I know I'm in the car with my mom and I take a few pictures and then she takes me home And then I took medication and then I started feeling better And I didn't really sleep the first day the first day I was actually like kind of high energy and I was feeling good Um, and then I ate or I drank Soup, um, yogurt, and smoothie. And that's literally all I've been eating. I've been eating croissant, little pieces of croissant. I ate a little bit of chocolate and ice cream. Ice cream on the first day was so good. I came home, I took medicine, and I just watched things. It was actually kind of nice. Like, I was feeling pretty good, honestly. I've been fine. I've been fine. I think yesterday and today, I'm feeling a little bit more tired 
Because on Friday, for some reason, I wasn't really tired. I was kind of energized and I was fine. But yeah, I'm feeling a little tired today and yesterday. And today is supposed to be the day where I'm the poofiest in the face. So I'm a little swollen, but it's not that bad. And it hurts a little bit, but I'm just scared because it still feels very like, like it could break and I'm scared, but it's doing, it's doing well. I'm doing well. And yeah, it was so much more smooth than I anticipated. I thought it was going to be like, I thought that I was going to be so like, I thought I was going to be so bad after, but it was really good. They didn't let, they didn't let me keep my teeth though. I was a little bit upset that I didn't have my teeth, but it's fine. I wanted to see how big they were. Definitely also your bottom teeth are like way more like painful like i don't even know that my top teeth are gone like it's really like your bottom teeth that like feel so uncomfortable and like you, you can really feel it but the top ones like also today my jaw hurts a lot more but yeah anyways that's my little story time it was really not anything crazy i don't feel like i was very like silly after i think that like you you, you feel silly after when they give you like the gas mask like the laughing gas and so i didn't get that i got like iv sedation so i wasn't really silly kind of sad i wish i was but i don't know if they do that a lot anymore i feel like a lot mostly like they do iv sedation anyways that's my story time i'm feeling a little bit better now i i was feeling kind of tired when i woke up but i feel fine now but anyways now i'm gonna clean up and then i want to show you guys some of the christmas gifts that i've gotten so far so i don't know and then i'm gonna chill that's my plan today anyways i hope you guys like this little vlog i'm excited for the next video because i think that next video I'm gonna like do a bunch of Christmas things so I'm excited for that make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it and make sure to subscribe if you're not yet and if you want to okay let's just get started I really don't want to but like I just have to okay let's get started
for Christmas for different people. I haven't gotten like all of the gifts yet, so next week I'm probably gonna wrap everything and so I can show you everything. I'm so excited. Um, so let me show you. Okay, so if I know you in real life, please like stop watching this. <laughs> because just like stop. Goodbye. If I know you in real life, goodbye. Okay, so I'm gonna start with my secret Sienna. I bought her this like cute like makeup bag. I don't know, it's just like such a good, cute like, I don't know. I got her this like face mask. I just thought it was cute, so I got it. I don't know, that kind of stuff is always like kind of exciting. And then I got her this little like lip gloss set and it's like cute and like cherry themed. So like, ah! I don't know. And then like the nice gift is, ooh, oh my God, I've never seen one of these like in real life, but it's like the Stanley cup. <gasps> Holy shit, they're so big. I've never like, they're so popular, but like I've never actually like held one. I don't know, I think this is so nice. Eey! Oh my God, I kind of want one for myself. Wow, that's my secret Santa. I think I'm also gonna bake her something because that's always fun. Then it's someone's birthday and the, this person's birthday, they're like very into like off-white. So I got him this like big book. It's like one of those like table books. I don't know what you call this. It's super nice though. So like, I don't know, I'm excited about it. It looks very, I don't know, looks very sleek and like cool. So that's exciting. Okay, for my mom, my mom always tells me to not get her anything, but I, she's like the person that I want to give something to like the most. So for my mom, I got her this little like, those little like paper building things. That's what I got my mom. And my brother, I literally have no idea what to get him. I'm getting him like cool like clothes, like active wear clothes. I only got him one thing, but I'm going to go back and give him more of anything. Boring. Then I got this other gift for someone in my family like this lush thing and I just thought that this was such a cute little box so it's like it has a bunch of bath bombs in it lush it's just such like a good gift like you know okay or I got this pair of I don't know if these will okay I got these cute pair of slippers for someone in my family too but like, I just think these are so cute. Oh my god, hopefully they fit. Anyways, they're just these little like frog slippers. Are you kidding? Adorable. I love them. For my sister, I didn't know what to get them, but my sister is like, okay, there's this account on TikTok of like really cute slimes and they do like this like scoopability test for slime and it's just so cute and we're really into that. So I decided to get her like a bunch of slime and it's so exciting. So I feel like she's gonna have fun and she's gonna like appreciate it. It's gonna be like just, I don't know. I just think it's fun. Like it's not something that like useful, but it's just like, it's exciting, right? It makes you feel like a kid again. I feel like this is also slime. Yeah, these little like packages of slime and the themes are so cute. I don't know, I think it's so exciting. I'm really excited to like wrap everything. So I just wanted to show you. Next week is gonna be so much fun because I'm hosting Secret Santa at my apartment and I hosted it here last year, but it wasn't like, I didn't really go all out. I kinda wanna go all out. So I'm gonna go to Dollarama and I wanna like decorate my apartment. Like I wanna take it to the next level with Halloween decorations. Whoa, Christmas, Christmas. So yeah. I'm so excited. Anyways, anyways, I'm gonna keep cleaning and then I think I'm gonna chill. I'm gonna eat some soup soon after I'm done cleaning and yeah. Okay, sorry, I feel like I interrupted the vlog, but I wanted to show you. Okay, anyways.
Mia. Es el acuerdo.